welcome in, alien lover. <laughs> I remember you for YouTube. It was so cute. Hi, welcome in. Can we get some yos? If you have any preferred nicknames or pronouns, make sure to tell me. But welcome in. First time chatter. Hi, Go Bobo. Welcome in. Can we get some more yos? <laughs> Yo yos are fun. Yes, sir. Um, alien lover, you should have. What can I call you? Can I call you alien? <laughs> if you look in the bottom. Wait, what corner is it? In the bottom of your chat room, you should have some free emotes. Feel free to spam them. Guys, face come on in five, four, three, two. <laughs> Yo, I'm live. Hello, good morning, good afternoon. Hope everyone is doing well today. I'm live on time. I am never gonna be late again. I told y'all I'm not gonna be late. <laughs> but I hope you guys are doing well. We had Kobobo and Alien, and they're just starting soon. Screen, thank you guys for chatting. Everybody does call me Alien. Okay, we'll keep that noted. So, before we get started, huge update, huge update. If you follow my Twitter, you know this already, guys. Follow my Twitter at PSIN17. Huge update. So, most of y'all know, if you're new, I have two. <laughs> I'm technically disabled. I have a... My brain is too big for my skull, and I have a spinal cord disease. And ever since September of 2022, I've been trying to apply for government benefits to try and get an official... Um, to be officially acknowledged as federally disabled. In order to do that, you have to prove that you're unable to work for X amount of time. And guys, it finally got approved! after nearly a year. Now, this process was very stressful. It took a long ass time because I have been out of work since um, 2021. I started showing symptoms of my disease in fall of 21. So, you know, I've been chilling for a while. So I'll, I'll just read off the tweet for the audio listeners. My- this was on Thursday because what happened was I got a phone call at 2 p.m. on Thursday, so when I was live, and I usually- I don't answer my phone anymore because there's a lot of scammers, so if it's important, people can leave a voicemail. And it was, um, a DSHS agent being like, hey, your benefits got approved, actually, you do not have to go to that hearing next week. And I was like, what? So, apparently, they reviewed my case again. Because finally, Multicare sent my actual, like, documents and data to DSHS, which they were two months late on. Whole debacle. But anyway. And they were like, oh yeah, actually you do have a rare disease. Lamau. So. <laughs> I'm gonna read it out loud. My disability benefits got approved! It's been nearly a year-long process and beyond stressful, but at least I'm a step closer to full SSI. It's partial benefits, not enough to cover all rent or living expenses, but at least I'm able to be fairly acknowledged for my condition. So this is important, because in order to get any form of benefits concerning disability, you have to prove that you are disabled. So that can be like a temporary disability or terminal in the sense- wait. Or fuck, wait, terminal means you're gonna die. I'm not gonna die, guys. I'm fine. I'm just gonna- I'm gonna have chronic pain forever. Um... When I say partial benefits for the program, for to get full SSI, there's like a transitional program where you get some cash benefits. Full SSI is when you get like um, a full living wage, essentially. And that's typically only approved for like severely handicapped people. But you know what? Maybe I need a cane one day. <laughs> so... Okay, next. Next tweet. Now I can apply for more federal resources, specifically for disabled individuals. So that can mean, um, rental assistance. So that way my sister doesn't have to cover my rent. That can mean, um, specialized healthcare. That can mean, like, therapy. It, c it can even mean glasses. I can get new glasses for free. Um, it can mean, like, food stamps or, like, more food benefits. So there's a lot more resources that I can apply for in the upcoming weeks and months now that I have... An official I'm officially credited as a disability it's gonna take like up to two weeks for, to process because I had to file, turn in paperwork on Friday and Monday um, 
I don't have to stress about paying my personal phone bill or groceries anymore. Doesn't mean I won't stop shilling primes. Guys, sub with Prime, it's free. Um, I'd like to once again thank you all for my for your support and patience. It's been a long ass time. Um, also, last thing I wanted to add, because I know some, I don't post about it often. Um, I don't share this often because I don't want my diagnosis to be my main identity, but I have a Chiari malformation, which is essentially my brainstem st hangs out past my skull. So, if I trip and land on my head, I die. Smile. Um, and syringomelia, which is, um, when your brain fluid leaks, because my brain sticks out of my skull, it leaks down my spine, and then it causes, um, syrinxes, or cysts, like, you know, cancer cysts, but it's not cancerous yet. Um, to, like, build in my spinal cord. Um, it's a neurological disease, meaning it affects your nervous system, so your ability to, like, move, function, and, like, feel things. Um, both cause pain, numbness, fatigue, vertigo, and brain fog. So, yeah. I got approved. You know, now I get a little bit of cheddar. Get the government cheddar. Um, I don't feel comfortable sharing the actual dollar amount. But, like I said, it's not enough to cover rent. And to put it clearly... My share of rent is $500. You can connect the dots and infer that the benefits I'm getting is less than $500. Um, guys, it's 11-11. Make a wish. Make a wish. Um, so, how this is going to work. How these benefits work. I just said the same thing twice. I'm not allowed to make more than $380 a month on my own. So, that means, you know, I can get some primes, but I can't get, like, a crazy amount of gifted subs every month, which I usually don't. Um, in terms of Twitch income, I usually average 100, which is what I reported that I make, okay? The government knows that I make $100 from Twitch every month. Last month, I made, I made 60 bucks, so... Income is calculated annually, so if one month I make 200, then that's fine. I just have to make less the next month. <laughs> so it's okay. Because I was thinking about it, I was like, am I going to have to stop streaming now? But I don't make enough money from stream to where it would disqualify me. So, because you know, I'm not popping. 379 subs? That would go crazy. Guys, can we get 20 subs today? You know, we'd be one step closer to 379. I'm back! Welcome in. Can we get some yo's? Hi, Mac. I just explained everything. Watch the VOD if you want lore update, you parasocial Andy. Um, I don't know if this means... Ain't no way! <laughs> Thank you for the gifted sub, Mac. Can we get some wax in chat? Oh my god, I went to Totoro, the brokey. They're gonna enjoy that gifted sub. Thank you, Mac. Thank you, Mac. Wait, ain't no way, number one on the leaderboard. Wow. Hello? So I can't, I can't. So, I don't know if I'm gonna be allowed to like sell paintings. Because since the average painting is like a hundred dollars, right? If I sell more than like one painting a month now, that, that can be kind of bad. But since it's technically a business, that's like a separate asset. So I don't, I don't know. I, I have to ask my agent. I'm meeting with them um, next week, I think. So I'm gonna have to talk to her about it. This is crazy. <laughs> Money fraud or tax fraud? <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Shut up. Shut new chatter. Shut up, guys. We cannot be slandering this early on. Um, so I don't know. I'll keep you guys updated. We'll, we'll, I'll figure it out. Either way, TLDR, Peason is getting that government cheddar, so now I don't have to worry about, like, starving. At least Dream won't have to stop. Exactly. I would be very sad. But, um, I, I know for, like, affiliates and partners, you can terminate your monetization at, like, any point, but then I would have to re-earn it. And that's kind of scary. And then you guys wouldn't have sub badges. You guys would just be no badge having asses in chat. Um, 
We're still gonna do a subathon next month. We'll still do it. Oh, okay. So for September, it new tier one subs will be I think twenty percent off or something. And then in the final ish week of September, gifted subs are discounted. So I I need to figure out if I'll be allowed to do a subathon. <laughs> Because what if- what if somebody goes crazy and then I lose my benefits? That would be very sad. Okay, any- anybody have questions? Any questions before we play the game? Another thing is I don't have to donate plasma anymore because um, donating plasma made too much money. <laughs> Because I was telling my agent, I was like, hey, I started donating plasma, and they were like, um, you should stop. What's plasma? So plasma is a protein that goes through your bloodstream. So it's kind of like, it's similar to donating blood, but plasma is like this watery substance in your body that is used for like medicine, it's used in emergency procedures. And when you donate blood, you can only donate every few months, but with plasma, you can donate multiple times a week. So there's a bunch of private companies in the States to where if you donate plasma, they'll give you money. There's usually a clinic in most major cities. Um, so I was... Because essentially, how my benefits work is if I make $100 in a month, then it subtracts $100 from my benefits. So, let's say one month I chose to donate $200 worth of plasma, then the next calendar month I would earn $200 less of ABD cash benefits. Which is kind of fucked. It's fucked. <laughs> okay, Splenda Mom, shut up. What, what does that even mean? Okay, I'm trying to cut back on my sugar. What, what, okay, what does that mean? <laughs> Hi, Kim. Welcome in. Can we get some yo's? Hi, Kim. Explain to me what Splenda Mom leaves before you go clock on back to work, Kim. You need to explain that. <laughs> Kim is a menace. Yeah, we should just ban her at this point. Honestly. You know what else we don't- Or we should do? We should play the game. <clears throat> okay, so this is an indie game that we saw in a Nintendo Direct probably back in like summer or fall of 22 because this game came out in November of last year and I didn't know it came out. So the, the game, the airtime for this game is like one and a half hours to two. So this might be a quick stream. We'll see unless I it did say it was a puzzle platformer. Y'all know how I am with puzzles, so we'll see. I used to play some Animal Crossing, and I got nostalgia watching that video slandering it. <laughs> it wasn't mine, right? I don't do too much slander. Your shirt is cute? <gasps> Thank you. I went to the mall because- okay. Oh, another thing that I kind of got scammed on. Full cam. I got scammed. Clippers. I got scammed. So, you know how my benefits got denied in June? And then it took two months to get a hearing. So, since my application got denied, um, essentially, because how most government benefits work is you get back paid for the actual calendar date you applied for. So since I applied for it in April, I should have gotten benefits back paid from April. But since it got denied in June, I only got back paid um, from June. So I basically missed out on $600 worth of cash benefits, which sucks. I mean, it's fine. I'm so glad that I got something. But, so minus 600, because that one L worker put the wrong diagnosis on my chart. It's so many L's, so many L's. Um, so minus 600, but I still got like, um, I'll say how much I got up front because I got my less than 500 a month for June, July, and August. And I just put it all towards my credit card. So now I'm almost out of credit card debt. And then I have to pay off my student loans. And then that's the only debt I have. So yeah, smile. Wait, I just realized. Hmm. Hmm. 
Hmm. Because we were talking about before, if you are disabled and federally acknowledged as disabled by the government, and you have federal student loans, you can get them waivered if you can prove that you can't work for more than three years in a row. Now, maybe I can be eligible for that. There's so much shit that I can apply for in the upcoming weeks that will genuinely help me so much and become somewhat independent. Because, you know, I can't live with my sister forever because she's technically disabled as well. She has autism. I'm allowed to share it. She said it's fine. It's just with her, like, she's physically able to work. So she's essentially not eligible for any form of government benefits besides just her disabled um, bus card. That's it. Or handicap bus card. But yeah, that's it. That's it. So things are looking up. Things are looking good. Guys, 2023 is going to be a good year. I'm glad your sister is able to do things, though. I know. She... <laughs> I went grocery shopping with her this morning and she was being such a little shit. It was frustrating. <laughs> well, you know what? I have to be nice to her. She did buy me a coffee at the end. Let's play the game! That's what they said about 2020. Uh, um, uh, we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. But honestly, I feel so much better now. Like... A weight has been lifted off my shoulders. Like, when I called my agent back, I was literally crying on the phone. I was so happy. My grandmother worked for a handicapped school bus, and she had me take her on with her once, and I opened my eyes so much as a kid. That's good. I mean, was she allowed to do that? I feel like you're not allowed to do that. <laughs> Because it's partially like a liability thing. Anyway. I do think it's important um, to have like integration for handicapped kids to be in the um, gen ed classrooms. Because if you segregate them, then when you're little, you need to understand that different people or ones who are different from you are normal. Because <laughs> I know when I was in elementary... The only time really really saw like the handicapped kids were during the assemblies. And sometimes during races, but most of the time like the kids who are severely handicapped, like they didn't go outside for a recess. Because we didn't have the accommodations for it. Does that mean more streams? Yes. I was gonna talk to you guys today. Um I can't farm subs too much, but do you guys want to bring back evening sub-only streams if we hit sub goals? Because I don't think I want to have my sub goal at 50 anymore. I think having like smaller gradual ones is better. Because now that I have more time and my sister, hopefully, she'll get a job soon. Hopefully. Because she finally got like a, a job coach. She had her first meeting last week and we have another one later in this week that I have to go with her too. So hopefully, you'll have a job within like three weeks max. Um, but yeah. Yes, I'm on time today. Imagine. I've been stalling for 20 minutes. Should I just go to just chatting? Just chatting. Okay, let's play the game. Goodbye world. This is supposedly two hours. Let's see how long it takes me to finish the puzzles. Now this is a pixel indie game about the struggle in life of two indie game developers. How meta. Now I think this one is mostly story. Okay, up, down, left, right. I got hit by a semi-truck in game. Oh, okay. I thought that was gonna be like the setup for like a mine, you know, like in Minecraft. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, I also I got Shovel Knight because I went to a GameStop because we went to the mall, and this one had so many used games. I think I will start the I work a nine to five streams. Maybe this week or next week. The first one we'll do is let's build a zoo and then I'll get pressure washer soon. <clears throat> I've been in the mood to do like one-off games. 
you know, just to experience something new. Mario Kart will make a comeback, don't worry. Okay, let's get started. Number one. Some fools in the world hide how they truly feel. They think if they tell the truth, people would think they're lame. Or maybe think they're crazy. And they can't stand the lie. But because they're not very smart, they let the truth slip. Oh no! <laughs> Matcha camera? Hold. Hold. <laughs> Matcha? Waiting, waiting for the camera. Saved. Oh, you know how there's wildfires in Washington right now? It's surprisingly bringing down the temperature. <laughs> like, right now it's like 60 degrees outside when normally it's been like 90. And that's like the only good thing about the wildfires. Hmm. They let the truth slip in places people would notice. That, to me, is one of the lamest things anyone could do. Goodbye, world. You know, the title is very, like, morbid. Game by Isolation Studio. Music by Old Nut. Support by Fly High Works. I just realized my tripod is so crooked. It's at like a t angle. Yeah, usually there's annual wildfires in Washington. Ooh, March 2017. Four years ago. Because I know Washington is like the rainy state, but usually the eastern part, it's a lot of like farmland, a lot of plains. So usually there's a bunch of wildfires in eastern Washington or up north somehow that like kind of leak down from Canada. But you know, thankfully I'm not in a hazard area. The only scary thing is like Mount Rainier. But if Mount Rainier blows, literally everybody's dead. Literally everyone. Anyway, <laughs> March 2017, when I graduated four years ago. Both me and Kani-chan were still studying in college. Why is it dusty? Blocks. Oh, I... Okay. Oh, I'm gonna forget all this. I don't- I don't care. Just put me in, coach. Easy. Let's go! The glowing- oh, I missed the hint. The blocks you broke can be set elsewhere. Oh shit! <laughs> Can I just skip this? There we go. Ta da! It's not like Mario, I can't jump on them. Go again. It's weird because like jumping is not like B or A. It's you have to tilt the directional stick up.
Hi, Kimari. Welcome in. Can we get some yo's? Hello. Oh, I made it. Okay. If it gets stuck, try starting over. Now I'm good. I think I'm kind of getting it. Oh, I can't place the block where I'm standing. Got it. Oh, I'm so smart! It's weird because, like, the consoles, like, subtly swing, too. Okay, I probably gotta make another staircase here. I hate platforming parts. Easy! Unlock the door to clear the stage. Second try! Imagine I just got stun lock there. <laughs> um, guys, we are 30 minutes in the stream, so if we're new here, follow the channel. You get cool emotes and the ability to type in chat. Can we hit our daily goal, guys? Smile. <clears throat> hey, Connie. Can't you talk it out? Talk? I just... I just want to make a game that I can be happy with. And I know I can't do it with her, so talking it out would be pointless. I'll have you know, the entire point of this assignment is to learn how to work as a team. We'll work towards the contest, but winning it isn't the objective, right? Oh, there's no indicator to know who is talking, so I'm just going to assume. I know that. But still... I don't want to enter the contest with a mediocre product, but... Excuse me. I came in to hand in my assignment. I'm a little busy now. Can you wait a moment? Oh, okay. Sorry. Anyway, there's bound to be a problem whenever you work in a team. Can't you solve the issue with a discussion? Introverts be like... Fine. These so-called pixel art graphics are just normal illustrations shrunk in size, right? I don't even see any effort made to clean the line work. So, can you redo it and draw it in the style I requested? You're a programmer. What would you know about art? See, it's impossible. Does it really have to be in pixel art? Yes. Um. Sorry, mind if I interject? You're not gonna lie, protagonist is being kind of a bitch. <laughs> Hi, I'm Kumare. I'm in arts and design. I don't think we've talked before, being in different courses. You're Connie-san, right? In programming and development? Well, yes. You're looking for someone that can create pixel art, right? So, how about leaving that to me? Professor, would it be alright if I switch places with the other artists for this assignment? If both parties are agreeable, I don't see why not. Sorry, it's hard for me to read the text because my tripod lines up exactly with the font. <clears throat> That's a bit better. This game feels like I'm having a fever dream. Yeah, the filters are kind of weird, huh? It's like you have 
the blue and green 3D film glasses on. If both parties are agreeable, I don't see why not. I'm in agreement. I can't stand working another segment with a selfish jerk like Connie. I actually wanted to try my hand in pixel art, but my team was against it because the style is too old. Connie, what do you think? Can you really do it? I'm pretty certain I can. Oh. This assignment I was about to hand in should have a sample of my work in dot style. You can see and decide for yourself if I have the skills you're looking for. And that's how we started making games together. And they were roomies. <laughs> yeah, if you guys want a mock Subway pizza, all you need to do is order the flatbread and then ask for, or flatbread spicy Italian, only pepperoni, and ask for them to put marinara on first. And double cheese. They still don't have the Subway pizza in my area. But some of the Walmart Subways, they have like pretzels. And slushies. It's kind of wild. April 2021. After we graduated from school, we never got a full-time job. We decided we'd make a living by making games together. But reality was harsh. Instead of spending time making games, most of our time was spent working part-time jobs. Dude, real. Real. I worked two part-times. No, two, one full, one part-time back in 2020-21. Oh, black box. Oh, I think it died. <laughs> okay. And it sucks because I genuinely feel like if there was, like, a four-day work week or just, like, if you can make enough income off of, like, part-time, like, even 30 hours a week, I feel like people would be so much more creative. You could pursue, like, your genuine passions. You could probably take care of your home more, like, cleaning and maintenance. It would just make life so much better. Oh, what? I love the sea. The salty air stings. Sand blocks can't be set even if you break them. Oh, that's D.O.M. They will also fall without support. Okay, so I can break some blocks. Because there's one normal block in the middle. Oh, I did it wrong. Oh wait, no, it's in my queue. See, I have a number one. I do have a block there. <laughs> Dude, I'm murking the frogs. Oh shit. This one might be a di bit difficult. I'm back, my whole screen was glitched. Are you watching on Twitch Mobile? If so, that's normal. <laughs> if you have the ability to watch on desktop, do desktop every time, man. I think oh, I, I just screwed myself I really hope I don't need to get another block later oh 
Oh, okay. It looks like I can get, I can get more blocks later. I'll just stick with what I got. <laughs> I don't need it. I have to go back. Oh, I haven't had a chance to look at the um, Discover or the Featured tabs yet that they announced today. It will be interesting to see if anybody does see crossover from it. Because not many Twitch users go to Twitch to watch clips. So similar to when YouTube first integrated its YouTube Shorts section, it's going to be a hot minute before the user base on Twitch gets used to... Oh, I can't break that block now. It's going to take a while before users get used to... Um, short form content on the platform. I think there was a while ago when YouTube... I think it was like a year after they started launching shorts. Like, sometimes when you would open the YouTube app, it would automatically open with a short speed. So it will be interesting to see the actual outcome of it. It does not look good on Twitch staff. Don't listen to Kobo. <laughs> but yeah, I saw on the Twitch support Twitter, they showed like how a horizontal video would look. And it looks so bad. You know what, Twitch? Twitch staff, if you're listening, if you're listening, if you're lurking, what you need to do is similar to the editing clip function in the creator dashboard. You know how where you can have a crop for your camera and crop for the game? What you need to do is whenever a creator features, a, selects a featured clip, have like a toggle to do like vertical crop. That way it'll automatically like save presets and have it to where creators can toggle! No checkpoints. Just copy YouTube? Honestly, yeah. Just copy YouTube. Smile. I love the sea, I love the sea, me and the sea. In tranquility. <laughs> I'm watching while playing Fall Guys, this music is better? Yeah, this is a lot better than the intro screen music. I will be honest. I wonder if this is the game that the developers in-game made, or this is just like their PSP. Come on. Oh, I can't put a block up top. Oh, wait. Was the level really this short? Okay, wait, wait, wait. Ain't no way. Easy! I thought it was like twice as long. This looks like old Kirby. The character does look a lot like, you know, the, the Waddle Dees. Hey! Oh! Hi, boss. How's it going? What are you doing? What? I'm just uh, playing a game. You idiot. Do your work. Urgh, I'm really mad. Do your work. I thought something was off about you, even during the interview. But I didn't think you'd be this useless. Sorry. What is the matter with you? 
Well, you said I could take it easy when there are no customers around. So I thought maybe I could game just a little. Stop making excuses. Jeez. I don't care if you're a game creator or whatever. Get some common sense, won't you? Do you know what people like you are called in this world? A social misfit, that's what. I feel sick. The winners? Exactly. We love that mindset. What am I supposed to do in this situation? Just not mess around on the clock? Okay. Guys, if you have a job and it's not super busy, if you're gonna, like, fuck around on your phone, do it at the back. She was sitting in the front lobby. Like, if me as a customer sees you on your phone, just go in the back, okay? Don't let people see that you're messing around. You know, make sure you're out of view of the camera so the boss don't see it. Oh, that's right. Think of the cat. There. Much better. Okay, I have to calm down. Hey. Your games aren't selling and you're short on cash. That's why you're working here, right? Did you ever consider your games don't sell because they're made by a loser like you? Bro! Why is he being so mean? He sounds just like my dad. Are you listening? I've had enough. That's my line. Just fire me and stop shouting. Connie-chan not being able to stick to one job was one of the reasons why it was a struggle to make a living. You know, some of us girlies just aren't designed to work. <laughs> Number three. Not saying I'm one of them, but you know, working ain't fun. Later that day. Every time we made a game, Connie-chan lost more confidence. The reason was simple our games wouldn't sell. Of course it hurt. Fathers be scolding about everything? Nah, my mom was the scold there. Okay, I'm gonna do this first try. Oh no! <laughs> Not the night levels. I'm gonna- this- this- oh no, what if I die? I only have three lives, I'm- oh no. I'm gonna do it, I need to stop thinking negatively and just do it. Shia LaBeouf, just do it. Caves are dark. Uh, do it, I know, I know, You're crazy. Who would've thought? Oh, I think I know what I must do. Okay, I do not know what I must do. I don't think I can... Oh, there is a way for me to get up top. I ain't doing it. I ain't doing it. Look carefully before you make a move. It's kind of hard for me to see in the dark, though.
How? Okay. I have to get those previous blocks somehow. Oh, I'm still unlocked. Okay, I can jump and break. Oh, I think I have to go back. That was it. Yes! Okay. I got it now. So I don't think there was a way for me to be able to get those three blocks at the start. Because I would I was only given one block at the start. Okay, so that one I think has to stay there because there's no way for me to go back and get it. Biggest brain. That's disappointing. I do feel like a lot of retro games are so much less forgiving. At least I know the pattern that I gotta do. I think this block in the center might be stuck now, because you can only break blocks from the side. You think I'm- I might have messed up the puzzle already. Yeah, there- oh no. I can't- I can't reset. Okay, 
Okay, since I can put blocks here, there's gotta be something hidden up top. If I had one more block, I'd be fine. I mean, I, I'll try and progress and see if I can somehow make it. block here. It doesn't seem like it has it would be beneficial for any platforming. Yeah, this block has to stay here. And I, I cannot get this one back out. Yeah, I only got two. Damn. I think I need three. Oh wait, I can still make it. Okay, okay. Now I just have to not die. If you die in the game, you die in real life. Everybody knows this. There we go. Yeah, you don't need to put a block in the center, it's unnecessary. I do want to see if there's anything up top top. Not me moving my head thinking I can see more. <laughs> okay, I don't think there's anything hidden up top. I may max four blocks. I think what I need to do is I need to put a block here, so that way when I land, I have a surface to jump on. No! No! 
Game over. You know who else will be game over for? The non-subs, because everybody, we are an hour in a stream, so it's time for me to run some ads. You can avoid that ad by subscribing for four ninety nine, just five dollars. Skip your coffee and get ad reviewed, ad previewing all month long. Or you can link your Amazon Prime to your Twitch and hashtag sub for free with Prime. Click subscribe. See if you have a Prime sub available. After the ad, we're gonna keep on playing. Surely. I'll beat the next puzzle, right? So if you don't want to miss a single second, subscribe. Get some water, get a snack. I could have gotten it! If it weren't for those silly frogs. Oh hey, Connie-chan! Why are you here? Oh. Welcome home. I thought you would work today. Oh. Well... Oh. I quit. It wasn't for me. Again? Oh. Like I told you, it's not for me. Oh. A 9 to 5 job, socializing... Uh. You do realize we're in a tight situation, right? How can money be tight? They have a pool table. Pool tables are expensive. Only rich people have pool tables. <laughs> I know. I'll find another job soon. Anyway, I read your script. How was it? The story about saving a princess from a demon lord. Right? It's a classic storyline. Nowadays. We don't want to save a princess from a demon lord. Then, what do you suggest? Hmm. For example... Having the protagonist die halfway unexpectedly, or having a plot to us somewhere, or using metafictional ideas. We need something like that to get people talking about it. To get people talking? Huh? Also, I need to discuss the fact that the gameplay is secondary to the plot. Hi, Chan, that was your idea. You said you wanted to make a game centered around the storyline. They're fighting. Yeah, I did. But what is the meaning of continuing this way? Making an old school game with a predictable ending? What do I be creating a game that isn't worth making? Let me guess. You're suggesting we start over again? Drawing attention, having meaning, whether it's worth it or not. I don't think any of that mattered to you when we created games in the past. But of course. Now it's work. It's different. After we started making games professionally, Connie Chan began to change. Connie Chan is all about the bag now. Number four. April 2017. About a month after we met, I remember asking Connie Chan a question. It was also the same time I started calling Connie... Connie Chan. Time to redeem myself. I will not die. Mm-mm. That ain't me. Ooh, the dreaded water level. Careful of the lava! The dreaded lava level! Watch your step! 
That Game Boy is so beat up. Yeah, it has, it has it's had cobwebs on it for months. Oh, the lava rises. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> I can do it. I just have to be quick. Oh, I can place blocks when the lava is going. Interesting. Last try. Oh. <laughs> I would be after the money if I were her. <laughs> I mean, let's be honest. If you're struggling, you'd probably want to do anything to get by. But if I wanted to make money... Wait, oh no. Like, with my artwork, then I would I would just be making fan art. You guys know this. Oh no. How is she able to see the screen? Um, she's cool. If I would have done this the right way, I would have stayed in that first T like section and then placed the two blocks and then jumped on top. Boo! Wait. Hacking. Hacking! Oh, I can't jump that high. Might be stun locked. I only got one block left. It does seem kind of hacky that I can just jump and then place a block. But I ain't hating it. Okay, I think I have to jump up top. Yes, sir. And there's lava. I have no blocks. Chan, can I ask why you make games? Hi, Chan. Having a nickname would bring us closer, don't you think? You can call me Kuma Chan, too. No thanks. Okay. I'll be honest, I don't like nicknames too much either. I do kind of wish I was able to do more of the retro games when I was younger. Like, I do understand that emulated will never be the same. 
Here's your order. Puffy? That's me. And a wiener melong. Is that... Is that all? Yes. Please enjoy. Damn, diner food sounds so good. I'm a sucker for breakfast. So, why do you make games? I, she has space buns. Oh my god, that's so cute. Why? Well... Sips coffee. So I can get a job in the industry, I guess. That's why you want to do well in the contest? That's right. Okay. What's that face? Nothing. You have something to say. Nothing. <laughs> or writes her name in Death Note. <laughs> I just thought, if you're really doing it for a job, wouldn't you make a game more suited to the current trends? And called her out. Then let me ask, why do you draw? I draw because... Whenever you can create a feeling in someone, may it be a surprise or excitement even, when I see that shift in emotion, that's when I feel truly alive. And it just happens that the way I can do that is by drawing. Your coffee's gonna get cold. I prefer it that way. We became closer as time went by. The more we got to know each other, the better our game got. Everything was so fun at this time. And then it went sad. Dun dun dun. <laughs> Why is she always playing her little Game Boy? Number five. She does not put that thing down. I guess I was being optimistic. I thought overcoming those tough times would add to our personal growth. So I thought I'd continue to support Connie Chan on this endeavor. But I was wrong. I... For a very long time... I haven't seen Connie-chan enjoy making games from the bottom of our heart. That's why... I... Is she gonna leave the project? That, that'll be so sad. Blocks! I have no clue. I'm clueless. Yeah, I die.
I can only place a block here. Oh, that kills the frog. Okay. I was gonna see if I could break it. Ain't no way. I could not have seen myself solving that anyway. Dumb. Stupid puzzle. Is it fun? You mean this game? She's trying to riz her up. You see that? My controller would be broken playing this. I never threw a console, but I bet if I had a handheld one when I was younger. Because what I do sometimes is I would just drop things and not throw it. Like, there, <laughs> there's been a few times where I'm holding my pro controller and I'll just drop it in my lap. Because I'm like, I'm not going to, like, clench it. I'm not going to throw it and I'll just drop it. And one time, <laughs> I was playing handheld Switch. This was a while ago. So, like, the whole, like, display and everything. And I dropped it in my lap and then it bounced off my bed on the floor. <laughs> So, that it did not crack the screen. The only time I cracked the screen was when I fell asleep playing and it fell off my bed. It's just meh. But you play it all the time. Yeah. But it's just meh. You know, sometimes we like to play games to pass the time. It doesn't have to be fun. Th this is why people play Clash of Clans. Just to pass time. I really thought it said just meh. <laughs> no wonder we have no money. You're spending it all on drugs. Isn't that why your sister doesn't let you play her Switch? She technically gave her Switch to me because she has her own OLED, but she's still very, like, nitpicky with it whenever i play handheld she's like what are you doing i'm like i'm playing switch and she's like you should play docked and i'm like no clash of clans is fun <laughs> don't say don't say that that that's not bad it was kind of funny but let's not say writer in the chat <laughs> this is not a squeak stream It's a character? Wait, it's in- Oh no. Oh no. Dude. I'm so- st No, you're not stupid. It's fine. I just have an immature mind. Wait, is that actually a character? Wait, I wanna look him up. I wanna look him up. Oh my god. I was like, new chatter, oh no. <laughs> At least you didn't get banned for that one. <laughs> Shame, not gonna lie. <laughs> okay. Hog R I D E R is the Clash of Clans is the third recommended search. Oh, he literally rides a hog. <laughs> Let's play the game. <laughs> that was hilarious. Okay. <clears throat> I used to think it was fun. But from a great but from a game creator's perspective, it's just meh. I see. 
The interface isn't well done. It's hard to understand. Even the level designs are whack. Well, you know all about that. Does she have a Starbucks apron on? <clears throat> I wanted to tell you I've decided. Decided what? I'm getting a full-time job. Pop off. What? Why so suddenly? It wasn't sudden. I got an offer from my boss. A long time back. He wanted to hire me full time for a while. Till now I've been turning him down. <laughs> because you don't work. <laughs> you know, you can pursue your passions while working full time. You just have to stay up till 2 a.m. every night to work on your game now. <clears throat> Are you okay with the fact you won't be able to make games anymore? Do you remember the promise we made? What promise? I guess you don't. You know, in my job at the cafe, it is a Starbucks apron. <laughs> they let me illustrate the menu and create boards for special deals. That's kind of cool, actually. That one. Of my dream job is to be the person who makes the Trader Joe's signs. That'd be epic. And the customers that come by tell me my designs are cool. Or my pictures are pretty. They just look genuinely pleased with my work. And that's enough for me. My shrink jump. Muds. Muds. I'm not saying it. Wait, aren't there people who work at like perfume places? Look it up. Bruh. <laughs> Picture you in like kindergarten being like other kids are like I want to be astronaut I want to be fireman alien rights I want to be an armpit smeller <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> Mac can you get me a cheese pizza please I want deep dish it's so intriguing you know I don't think that's the job for me I'm not writing that down on my list of jobs I want. I deal meal. That's all I gotta say. <clears throat> I'll go now. Hey, Connie-chan, can I ask why you make games now? Thanks for everything. It was fun. It's not like she's moving out. She just will be homeless. Less often. Can she just go face palm? Oh, back to her game. I know for myself, whenever I get anxious or worried, like I'll put on a video. And it's gotten to a point where like I know I'm disassociating. So I'm trying to like not use my my phone as much. But it's hard. Deep dish sucks. I haven't tried it. Don't ruin it for me. I want to try it.
I mean, coping skills are loud. Yeah. I'm gonna put my hair up. It's bugging me. I have found that, like, <clears throat> popping in an Altoid, like an actual Altoid, not anything else, helps ground me a little bit, like, just, like, the intense flavor. Helps me a bit. I ain't talking to people. I mean, you don't gotta talk out about your feelings all the time. Like, you definitely have to find coping skills that you can do on your own. Um, look up grounding techniques. Which is a kind of like breathing exercises, sensory exercises. You drink ginger ale and look at yourself in the mirror? Hmm. That could work. Oh, ginger ale is gross though. Wait, what happened? Did she knock herself? I missed it. I hear a cat. Number six. I wonder where it was that I started to believe in myself too much. I never fit in anywhere. Can't even hold a proper conversation. When did it happen? That someone like me started to believe I could make something that would bring me praise. When did I start dreaming? Creating these conceited delusions? The real me... Is someone that can't even deal with how my best friend feels. I'm so selfish. Oh no, we're in our emo arc, everybody. We're at the beach, everything's so happy. Surely I'm not being depressed right now. I don't think I can get that block. My game is so happy. I think I soft locked myself. Oh, right here, right here, okay. Never mind. Everything is okay.
Oh, I have to go up top. Fuck. Reset. It was a bad run anyway. Surprised my gamepad hasn't died yet. Seems like all I do is play it. No! Misclick. Wheeze, wheeze. September 2017. Are you alright? Yeah. It happens sometimes. Okay. Hey. Honey Chan. What makes you feel safe and happy? Do I have to answer that question now? Just tell me! It can be anything. Something that makes me feel... happy. I guess, um... Cats? Maybe? Dude, is this game about my sister? <laughs> That's so unexpected! I imagine you dislike animals. Got a problem? Did you ask just to make fun of me? Oh, no, I, I didn't mean to. I just wanted to share something I do all the time. Whenever I'm nervous or under stress, I think about things I like. Give it a try, Connie-chan. It might make you feel better. Maybe I will. Will the representative please step on stage? That's you! I know. Cats! Think about cats! Alright. Hey. What? Thanks. Oh, cute. We At the Inner Colligate Game Contest held nationwide for students, we won first prize. It was completely unexpected. Because I was simply making something I wanted to make. What am I doing now? Wait, so they're in college this whole time? Bruh, she had a full-time job and classes. Number seven. July 2021. After that, I continued making games alone. Oh. Something designed for hype. Having reasons behind creation. I try not to think about any of that. And then, I finally made one game. <laughs> Girlie was getting no work done. Yeah, she was being lazy. Goddamn millennials and zoomers don't want to work anymore. They need to get a job. Oh no, I'm gonna die. Bro. Need that block? No way. What's a zoomer? Um, zoomer is anyone born past 2000, I think, right? 
Like Gen Z. Okay, I think I'm actually stunlocked. Oh shucks, I'm a zoomer. So is my sister. I'm a I think I'm Gen X because I'm born right before 2000. My sister's a little zoomer. Can I skip this? There's no hints either. Oh, I have to go this way. Never mind. I figured it out. Them goddamn iPad kids. <laughs> There's way too many of them. Hacking. Ain't no way. I gotta go back. Hey, thank goodness there was no frog down here. Oh, damn, there's two blocks. Okay. Oh, I can't, I can't go back and get those. Those are the blocks I used to get over the initial wall. This, like, platform part is actually kind of nice. It is forcing me to use my little brain. I missed a key. Don't it stop? I don't know how to say key. <laughs> Maybe it's up here.
because, okay, I needed more blocks to get past. I think that was at the very start. Oh, but I'm only going in with two. Actually, four. I think I can do this. It breaks them. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Easy peasy. Now I have to make it back without dying. This level is so long. No! If I had this game on my little Game Boy, I would never play it again. This is... It's fine, like, it's not... It's, it's not difficult, it just takes a long-ass time. Oh yeah, still locked here, okay. This is gonna be using all my brain power I had allotted for today. And my budget is like, um, 30 watts every day. Time to go back.
You know, they should just make a game like this. Everyone would, would be hooked to it. It does remind me a bit of, like, all the Mario levels, or Mario Maker levels that people would make. That would force you to do, like, unconventional- UNCONVENTIONAL WAYS of using, like, the items in-game. Should I play Genshin Impact or Skyrim? I've never played both, and we hate gotcha games, so Skyrim. Why the gotcha game hate? Cause they make you spend money! All your hard earned doubloons! The only game that I bought, like, in-game currency in was Pokemon Go. But that's because I I use po I would play Pokemon Go like every day. Oh yeah, I'm poor. I should play Skyrim. She told you. Told you. Let me. Second try. Any chance could be so happy I beat it? Hmm. Well, it's certainly playable. Thank you. So, what do you think? We're asking if we'd publish this, right? Well, the answer is no. Um, why? You brought in a really old console. You know we don't publish for this, right? Damn. I don't mean it to be published specifically for that console. Really. What's the sales pitch, then? It's made to run on retro consoles. That's pretty unique. That doesn't add much to the actual gameplay, does it? In fact, that would limit distribution. That's a negative to me. Besides, if the customer were to choose, wouldn't they prefer to play on the... Wouldn't they prefer to play one of the old masterpieces? Why would they choose to play a fake retro game made by an unknown creator? He's tearing us apart! It happens surprisingly often that in pursuit of originality, creators lose perspective. I- I just... Just what? Oh. 
I just wanted to make something I truly wanted to create. Huh. That would be totally fine if you were doing it as a hobby. Take a good look around you. This is an office. We're a company doing business. If you could make money by simply doing what you want, life would be so easy. Yes, sir. <laughs> <laughs> to be honest, what caught my eye in your games wasn't the game itself. It was the pixel art Miss Kumade created. Now that that's gone, I don't see any value in the games you bring me. He's so mean. You mentioned you two separated because of artistic differences. What are you, an indie band? Are you sure Miss Kumade didn't leave? Because you started making games that won't sell? Kumade didn't... Kumare didn't what? Look, I'm still smiling. Smile. Huh. I thought you came here to talk. Kumare. Only Kumare. So value in the games I made. I know why Kumare left. The real reason why. Lore! Number 8. September 2017. Matt Pat needs to get in here. Yeah, lore time. Ooh, another lava level. I'd buy this game. I did buy this game. The reason why I was reminded of it is because I saw it at the GameStop. And the physical version of this game was about $35, but the digital download was, I think, $12. Because when I saw the case, I was like, oh, I forgot about this one. Oh, fuck! Oh, shit! <laughs> okay. <laughs> um. I can do it. The floor is lava. Oh, I thought I didn't wait long enough. Thank God. How are the frogs still living? They should die! Oh no! I bet if I had one of these little Game Boys when I was little, I would have learned how to curse sooner. I didn't curse until high school. Because I was such a goody good. I live. I think this is my last life. No! Oh. 
Oh, okay. God! We got the prize because of you. Kimare. All the judges praised the visuals. They didn't really talk about the game itself. Oof. Are you being humble? You know I'm not the sword. Yeah, I do. Hey, do you know why I asked to do the art for your game? Why? Because I was looking for someone that could do pixel art and you wanted to try your hand in it, right? I wouldn't have offered the, for that reason alone. I hadn't even talked to you before, after all. Then why? In my freshman year, I went to the exhibition held by students in programming. You know, the one for the end of year projects? Must have been boring. All the games displayed were poor copies of hit games, and I was a bit disappointed. I bet. But then... There was this desk with a single console placed on it. Everybody was doing their best to promote what they made, calling out to people to come play, but nobody was at that desk. And it was apparent nobody was gonna come. Nobody took notice of that game, so I decided to give it a go. Really? The game felt so nostalgic. It brought back memories of games I used to play as a kid. Knowing there was someone in school that could make something like that made me really happy. Can you tell who I'm talking about? Connie-chan, your game really touched me. It was a coincidence we met at the teacher's room that day, but I've been waiting for a chance to talk to you for forever. Aww. I was gonna say, let's make a game together. That's why. I don't want you to think you did nothing to deserve the prize. Thanks. Well, to be fair... I also thought it would be better if I did the graphics instead. <laughs> Honey Chan, you know, you can afford to be more confident. <laughs> Dude, why is she roasting me? She was glazing and now she's roasting. That movement was so good. I think... I won't get a full-time after... I won't get a full-time job after I graduate. I thought you said you were making games to get a proper job in the industry. Do you seriously think I could work in a corporate environment? Lately... I hear there are a lot of people that make games independently. I thought maybe I could give that a try. I was thinking. It was fun working with you. So. If you're up for it. Would you like to join me? I think I can make good games if it's with you. Sure. <laughs> Let's do it. Really? It sounds ambitious, but I love a challenge. Besides, making a game with you was fun for me, too. Are these sisters are gay? <laughs> <laughs> Can you 
promise me one thing? It's all fun and games while we're students, but I bet things will be different once this becomes our job. After we turn professional, you might start feeling different about creating games. It might become stressful or even overwhelming. So, if we can't make games with the passion we feel now, let's not push it and quit. Promise? I never forgot. It's just that I said I remember the promise. I felt like I'd have to face the truth. The truth that now making games had become suffocating. And I was scared to admit it. That's why I pretended to forget. If I didn't lie to hide how I feel, maybe things would have been different now. Kumara might have never left. Maybe we would still be making games together. If I'd just been honest. Number 9. 9th of July, 2021. You know who else has to be honest with themselves? The non-subs, because everybody, we are two hours in a stream. So it's time for me to run some ads. You can avoid that ad by subscribing for $4.99, just $5. Skip your coffee and get ad-free viewing all month long today. Or you can link your Amazon Prime to your Twitch and hashtag sub for free with Prime. Click subscribe, see if you have a Prime sub available. Is stream elements broken? Ain't no way. Me and the homies love elements. Anyway, um, subscribe everybody. Get some water, get a snack. We'll see some of you guys in a few. I need some water. I'll take my mom's wallet. Don't. In Minecraft. Don't. I do not advocate for stealing wallets. You know, just use your chore money and be like, Hey, yo, ma. <laughs> Back to blocks. I think they're gonna get into a huge fight and then never see each other again. And then they're gonna reunite and become lovers. No way. Ain't no way. I'm gonna get a running start. Oh, I live. I live. <laughs> God. <laughs> One life left. Come on. Okay, that frog is stun locked now. This is insane! Oh my god. Peace I 2 7, everybody. That's insane. What are the developers thinking? Hello? Hello? Honey Chan? 
Hi, Kumare. It's... or oh, it's been a while. What's up? Well, uh... I was wondering how you're doing. Is it 2 a.m. on a Friday night? Oh, so you do care about me, hmm? My training period ends this month. After that, I work full-time with benefits. Don't I sound all grown up? Yeah. Cool. So what are you up to, Connie-chan? Still making games? Yeah. So, how is it going? Well... I did it. I made a game. What? I took it to a publisher. That's great! Not really. It wasn't received well. Oh. Got told it wasn't good enough. So, if you have the time, if you don't mind, date? Can you come try play the game I made? I'd appreciate some advice. Hmm. Well, um. Sorry, guess you're busy. Oh, um, <laughs> that's not it. I was just wondering if I could give any helpful advice to you at all. You can. Because you've always been the only one to take my game seriously. Okay. So, what's the plan? What do you mean? When do we meet? Tonight, 9pm. <laughs> I'll make you dinner. Any time is fine for me. Come at your convenience. Then, how about next Tuesday? Tuesday. 12th of July, right? Yep. Okay. What time? Anytime. I'm always home. Oh. The afternoon? Sure. Oh! Wanna grab lunch together? If you want. Okay. Um, great! We'll meet Tuesday afternoon, get lunch together, and after that I'll play your game. Does that sound good? Yeah. Anything else? No. Okay. Well, see you then. <laughs> this is like how I talk with my sister. She's a very good yes, no, um. <laughs> yeah. Later. Later! We're gonna smash. What shameless plug? Sorry, I, I like to go through the cutscenes fully before I acknowledge it. Um... I have an art shop where I sell paintings. Smile. So the shameless plug is where I show the website on screen. <gasps> Hashtag not an ad because it's my company. <clears throat> I wonder what Kamadi will think of this game. Would she find it nostalgic again? Would it move her? 
I couldn't tell her over the phone. But... I'm gonna say it when she comes to visit. That you love her! Do it! Maybe it's lame. But I'm gonna ask if she'll make a game with me again. Just a game? <laughs> Number 10. April 2019, what? Two years back? Wait, no, this isn't the... Wait. They were in school in 2017. Did it say 2021 at all? I think I'm memori memorizing it wrong. Gonna be the first try. Best love story of 2023? I know! Besides the love story that you and your- Fuck, me and your mom made. God damn it. I try. I try my best. I've come to like this little block game. This level is way too easy. This does not seem right. Oh no! <laughs> I give the comedy an S, but the gameplay is a C tier? Okay. <laughs> Don't make fun of my bio! I made it, like, literally when I made my Twitch channel, and I thought it was the most clever shit. <laughs> Kidding? No, it's funny. It's good. It's- it's good. I'm just trolling. I do think my bio is really good, though. <laughs> I wasn't really- I was rating it. No, wait till I play Mario Kart. I'm cracked. I played Mario Kart online, ranked online the other night, and I literally got three first place out of six games. I was cracked. You know, I'm only bad when I play on stream. And my stomach is growling. I don't know why it's growling. I had a, I had a full breakfast. Because usually on days when I don't stream, I'll eat breakfast at like... Eight or nine, and then lunch at two? Oh, it's almost two. Oh, I, I, I ate breakfast at like five, because we had to wake up early to go shopping. That's why I'm hungry. It's 3.14 for you? Oh, I'm on PST! It's 1.14. Last attempt. I'm getting pretty good at this blocking, though. Yeah, Washington is on the... West Coast. <laughs> it took me a long time to learn my Northeast, Southwest. I've never been good with, like, geography. But I'm really good at, like, navigating a map. Like, if we're lost, I can figure out where we are. Oh, no. Oh, no. Fuck you. Right. 
Let's start. <laughs> Marriage. <laughs> Surely. <laughs> if we could turn back time. Um. Sorry. Mind if I interject? Hi, I'm Kamari. I'm in arts and design. You're looking for someone that can create pixel art, right? So, how about leaving that to me? You can see and decide for yourself. If I have the skills you're looking for. Having a nickname would bring us closer, don't you think? You can call me Kumachan too. The plot twist is that one of us dies, like they were foreshadowing in the beginning. And they're like, oh, what type of game should we make? I'm gonna be so sad. So. Why do you make games? or under stress I think about things I like did she think about us on the stage sure let's do it <laughs> See, I, I beat you to the bit I beat you to the bit Yeah, honestly, Kumari was risen us from the start. Making a game with you was fun for me, too. From today onwards, this room is gonna be our place. Yeah, we're in this together. Kuma. Number 11. 12th of July, 2021. Kumari's <gasps> coming over! It looks kind of dark for the afternoon. Oh, I am not. I am not doing this. No way. Oh. Ain't no way. Jumped by accident. Game over. It's very late. When the day came, Kumari didn't come. Sorry, Kum Connie Chen. One of the part timers got sick today, and I've got to fill in the spot. Kumari had already found a new place to be. And I realized the days we'd spent together had already become the past. So, um, can I take a rain check? What I thought was the place I belonged to didn't exist anymore. Oh. 
Let's be honest, we all hate flakes. Did you ever consider your games don't sell because they're made by a loser like you? I'm in agreement. I can't stand working another second with a selfish jerk like Connie. What caught my eye in your games wasn't the game itself. It was the pixel art Miss Kumade created. A loser like you. Selfish jerk. I don't see any value. You know, in my job at the cafe, they let me illustrate the menu and create boards for special deals. And that's enough for me. Oh. That's all I've got to say. It's hard when you kind of have to teach yourself to not be critical of yourself or others or misinterpret or always see like the negative. But just know that you will get to a point where you'll get past it and learn how to handle your thoughts. Oh no. She just went out for air. That's all she did. Nothing else. That's a first floor balcony. Number 12. Connie Chan, are you there? I'm coming in, okay? Hello? I just want to say this game is rated E for everyone. I did not think it would get like depression vibes. She's not wearing her apron. Hey, I got worried because you wouldn't pick up the phone. Hey, where are you? I can actually move now. It's the desk I used to work on. It's left the way it was. I don't want to go outside. It's a certificate. That's when we won first prize at the contest during our college years. That was an important event for us. It's a pot plant. It's dried up. I take care of the house, but if we had plants, they would die. They would die. It's an old second-hand pool table. Connie-chan wanted to add a fun touch to the room. But I never seen her play pool once. There are a lot of boxes on the steel racks. They contain sneakers. Honey Chan used to have a thing for sneakers during college. When development games started getting hard, she suddenly lost all interest in them. It's a pot plant. It's dried up. It's Connie Chan's apron from her last job. She never returned it after she quit. I still had some sub. I kept my subway shirts for a while. But I threw them away. 
Because I was thinking I could use it for a bit, but I don't think you can use, like, actual iconography or logo <laughs> from, like, a company. If you don't want to get in trouble. You have 850 points? Let's go! Yeah, because I had some of the green Subway shirts, and then the black ones, and then... Our store never got the shirts that had, like, Eat Fresh on the back, or, like, the, the fresh slogans on it. I really wanted those. I have 250k? Holy moly. You think you can get to a million this year, Mac? I just got a million channel points in Hassan's chat, and I was so happy. I felt so... How do I say? Invigorated. No, honestly, if <laughs> if y'all need more channel points, I need to stream more. Who's Hassan? <laughs> He's like one of the largest streamers on the platform. He does political content. You know, if you don't know him, then probably don't watch him. <laughs> Keep watching your little game content. <laughs> he never games. Okay. Oh, I missed the text. What did it say? It's... Connie Chan's desk. There's a game console on it. The screen's cracked. Oh, was that a crack in the screen? <laughs> I did. I thought it was cobwebs. I, I think it was actually meant to be crack. Oh, I don't want to go out. Please don't be on the window, so please don't be on the balcony. The window's open. She's still smiling. Connie Chan? Is she just like gone? Now Kumari's gonna see how wonderful this game is. I love blocks. Oh, finally, some tutorial. Hi, Kumare. The walking speed is also slower. Firstly... You've reached the last stage. Thanks for playing till the end. I meant it when I said you're the only one who takes my game seriously. I thought hard and long about what you said. You were right. I'd lost myself. I was concentrating on what would sell. It wasn't for the money. It was more about pride. I wanted to prove I could make a hit. And create something people would praise. I wanted to prove I'm capable. In the past, I was a lot more self-centered. I never thought of the player. I didn't care what they thought of my games. It was their fault they didn't get it. Dude, how pretentious. Okay. <laughs> I really believe that. I know I'm egotistical. Classic. Aware. <laughs> but... I felt so free then. I'd forgotten how I used to feel. But after you left, it all came back. So I made this game. This is just... 
Something I truly wanted to make. The publishers hated it, but... I don't care about that anymore. It was fun to make. You've always asked why I make games. And I never gave you a proper answer. The truth is, I don't know myself. That's why I couldn't answer you. But now, I can tell you why. I make games because it's fun. That's all. Okay, this is a boring ass level, not gonna lie. I wanna tell you something. I love you. And this might cause you more trouble than good. But... When I was making games with you, it was even more fun. <laughs> Bring back old blocks, new developers, bad. <laughs> So, I wanted to ask you if you'd finish making this game with me. I don't care if it becomes the last game we make. Can we? Finally, some platforming, jeez. Try again. Imagine getting like a proposal or a promposal and they make a game for you and this is how they ask. Oh wait. Try again. What? Reset. Some fools in the world hide how they truly feel. They think if they tell the truth, people would think they're lame. Or maybe think they're crazy. And they can't stand that. So they lie. But because they're not very smart, they let the truth slip. In places where people would notice. That, to me, is one of the lamest things anyone could do. We hate liars. Wait, this is the game intro. Reset, retry. The clock is ticking, mocking the scenery. Should I tell you this feels like a source? That was a good debate. But that that was the intro. Or simply disregard every word that I say. That was nice. Whatever happened to Connie, though? Like, did she just, like, poof? She probably just went for, like, a really long walk. Also, how did Gumani like get into the apartment? Did she like have a key this whole time? You know what that means, right? <laughs> Your eyes are closing. I thought it'd be easier for you to Yeah, they were smashing. <laughs> You're not supposed to say it. <laughs> Muds. Is this all special thanks? They must have like a Patreon or something. Air striking. <laughs> Get him! No, if we want to do an airstrike, we just gotta call Obama. <gasps> I 
was nice. It was cute. The actual platforming levels... Like, if it were a game of just that, I don't think I'd like it, but the story elements added a lot. Like, it made sense to kind of sparse in between. And the reveal that it was the game that, you know, Connie made for Kumari was kind of cute. Are you sure the game's alright like this? Of course! Well, what now? Just... Why is it made like I died in the end? <laughs> you asked for it! Something with a plot twist, has metafictional ideas, and the protagonist dies unexpectedly! A story like this would get people talking, right? Classic. Bonus unlocked. I do think it was implied that Connie jumped, but if Connie jumped, you would like see, like, Kumari would have found, would have found her, you know? I think she just went for a very long walk. Love the stream. Thank you. Eh, glad you had a good time. It's not over yet, though. We're gonna see what the bonus is. Let's see. Bonus! Is this, like, where they smash? Oh. Blocks! Let's go! Okay, so I guess the bonus is just... Replaying all the block levels, which I don't want to do. But that's cool. The <laughs> smashing is like cookie clicker. <laughs> okay. Let's say... I guess if there is a time when I want to go back and try the little block levels, I can. But that was good by world! Cute story. Very on the nose. Like, I figured the way they ended it was gonna be like... When they were like, oh, you need to make a game like this! It has to do this! And that was gonna be like, the twist. I was right. I think it was still cute. Like, a good way to show... I guess the internal and creative struggle that artists do face whenever they do monetize their work. But very cute. I would say... 7 out of 10. Like, not too engaging. I do love- I'm a sucker for story games, but this one was very, like, cut and dry. I should make a game for my crush. Yeah, try it on Valentine's Day. Tell us next year how that goes. But everybody? We can wrap up here for today, but do not worry. Stream is not over yet because we do get to do calligraphy because we got a gifted sub from Mac in chat earlier. So, if you want me to write your name, all you need to do is um, donate to the channel or use your channel points and I'll write your name for free. Gentle reminder, if you are new here, follow the channel. You get cool emotes and the ability to type in chat. I'm gonna get some music on. And get that set up for y'all. Shameless plug? Are you talking about peace in art dot myshopify.com? What? H no way, guys. I sell original paintings. The paintings you see in the background of my streams are available for sale. You can get a certified hand painted piece of work by yours truly, guys. Um, type one in chat if you have a painting. Only one person can type one who's active in chat right now. Only one person. 
I mean, technically, I've I've given away two paintings. Yeah, I've had two collections so far. Next painting drop will be in September. I had to prolong August launch because, you know, I have to buy paint for the pieces I want to make. But the theme for September will be plants and foliage. Everybody, go bookmark the website. That way you can look at it later and stay up to date on new releases. I should lower the music. Don't wanna let you hold my hand But the day that I met you They all thought forever Puke green? Okay. <laughs> okay. I can't. My dear me. <laughs> I can't. Okay. Thank you for hanging out today, though, alien. What do you think of the stream? I know you're from YouTube. We usually just play games, we hang out, we goof and gaff. I think my favorite streams to do are Mario Kart still, because I usually just goof and gaff the whole time with chat, and it's really fun. loved it it was so funny and the game was so romantic <laughs> i mean i think i think they did smash Once again, thank you, Mac, for the gifted sub to chat. I appreciate it. Guys, can we hit, um, a thousand subs today? Opinions on Pokemon? It's good? I never played it when I was little. My first ever Pokemon game officially was Pokemon Go. And then my first, like, normal Pokemon game was Pokemon Eevee. Oh, Pokemane? Um, we love Pokemane. If I could, I would be a tier 3 sub, obviously. Once again, thank you, Mac, for the gifted sub. <gasps> no way! Thank you, Kobobo, for gifting a sub to Alien Lover. Yeah, let's go. Can we get some Woe Bobos in chat? Oh, I forgot about the overlay. <laughs> you can't even see me. I'm pogging. I'm pogging. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> Thank you, Kobobo, for another gifted. Thank you. That's two, baby. Sub goal. Oh, fuck. Did I say I'm going to do a bonus stream? Oh, no. Wait, roll the tape. Roll the tape. So thank you, Kobobo, for another gifted. It went to Aslane. Let's go. Another. That's one of the first subscribers I ever had. Thank you, Kobobo. What is this? Kobobo. Wait, wrong hand. Kobobo's now number one. Wow. Wow. But thank you. Enjoy the emotes, alien lover. Thank you. Okay, now we get to write Kobobo's name. Thank you, Kobobo. I appreciate it. You better use the gift cards I sent you, too. Even though they were late. You don't gotta use them on this channel. You can use them on, um, Ammo's channel. I 
I finally paid Cole Bobo for <laughs> all the best of compilation gift cards they earned. Wait, Cole Bobo, did you get your um, sketch card in the mail? I forgot to ask earlier. You should have gotten two. Or two cards in one envelope. I really wanted the Peace I Do Punch. I know, it goes crazy, doesn't it? Peace I Do Punch is, I think, legit the best emote I've ever made. The foreshortening goes crazy. I was saving it for September, but Alien was a good chatter. Aww. That's cute. Even though they said hog R-I-D-E-R. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> yeah, Alien was here for like the whole stream. Which is rare for first time chatters. So thank you for watching. It's a character in the game I didn't know! I didn't know! How am I supposed to know? I see the word writer in chat and I'm like, oh no. Oh no. Once again, thank you, Quobobo, Bobo, for the two gifted subs to chat. I appreciate it. Helping us hit our daily sub goal. Ain't no way. Um, let's see. I have to make dinner today. So maybe we can do a very, very, very late night stream at like 6 p.m. or something. For subscribers only. Does that sound fair? Tater tots? I'm the only one in my house who likes tater tots, unfortunately, so I can never justify buying them. Deal? Okay. Because my personal rule when I buy groceries is at least two people have to like said thing. What is the bonus stream gonna be? Not yet. There is a new update for Cult of the Lamb, though, that was published yesterday, I think. And apparently it's a crossover with um, Don't Starve. Wait, I think I just want to play Mario Kart. You guys want to do Mario Kart later? <laughs> Alien for sure smoked. <laughs> Back. <laughs> Okay, chatters, don't leak your age. Do not leak your age ever in a Twitch chat. Okay, do not ever leak. Do not ever leak. I'm just saying in general. Just saying in general. I don't want anybody to get in trouble. Wait, Chatters, do I seem like I'm high type 1? Be serious. Or be honest. <laughs> no, I mean, oh my god, when was this? I think this was last week. I was chatting downstairs with my sister and my roommate, and I was giggling because for some reason everything was really funny to me. I must have had like a dopamine rush or some shit. I think I did have sugar right before, but I was giggling at like every single question my sister was asking me. And they were like, are you high? And I'm like, no, I'm just really giggly right now. I think I was just zooted. I don't know what was going on. And like anytime they would ask me if I was high, I would just, I would just cackle. But I've, I've never smoked, I've never gotten high. Like seriously, I never have. I have no desire to.
Gentle reminder, if you want me to write your name, all you need to do is donate to the channel or use your channel points. Any more redeemers? I do think a I get five for the first time ever stream would go crazy. But I promised my friend if I ever smoke, I would do it with them, so... Sorry guys, you, you can't be there. <laughs> 10k viewers instantly? Imagine. Yeah, yeah, I would tell the story. That would be such a good clip. Peace and smokes for the first time. Story time. I would, I would obviously tell you guys. You know, I'm already pretty much a degenerate. Or a closeted degenerate. This is our last name, everybody. If you want me to write your name, all you need to do is donate or use your channel points. <laughs> Draw my life getting high edition. <laughs> is this what? 2013 YouTube? The golden days. There we go. Anybody else want to redeem? Any redeemers? I really want to play Cuphead for you guys because I'm just like so good at Cuphead, like genuinely. I will sing a song. Oh no. Oh no. Yeah, I think for sub only later, <laughs> we'll do Mario Kart because I want to play Mario Kart. Guys, I have to sing a song. Can we donate to your weed fund? Um, you guys can donate to my pay my college debt fund by doing, by tipping my streamlabs, and you can do T TTS. Let's sing a song. Any tippers? Yeah, there's also TTS enabled for bits, along with donations. Oh, god damn it! I instinctively opened Messenger, so now my friend is gonna say that I, I'm active on Messenger. Fuck! <laughs> Let's find a song to sing. Okay, I gotta pause music. Okay, everybody. Viewers can use their channel points to make me sing a song. Here's a playlist to all my other previous singing clips. So if you could spam your favorite animated, your favorite hype moments in the chat, that'd be great. Just like the day that I met you. The day I got forever. That's not the song I'm gonna sing. <laughs> I'm gonna try and love someone by Lucas Graham. It's been a long time since I've sung this one. If you could, everybody spam, spam, spam. What's your favorite emote? Put it in the chat. <clears throat> <clears throat> and there are days. I wake up and I pinch myself, but you're with me, not someone else. And I'm scared, yeah, I'm still scared that it's all a dream. Cause you still look perfect as days go by. Even the worst ones, you make me smile. I'd stop the world if it gave us time. Cause when you love someone, you open up your heart. When you love someone, you make room. 
If you love someone and you're not afraid to lose them, you'll probably never love someone like I do. You'll probably never love someone like I do. When you say you love the way I make you feel, everything becomes so real. And don't be scared, no, don't be scared. Cause you're all I need. I'm gonna try the final verse. I messed up the, the last part of the chorus. Oopsie. All my life, I thought it'd be hard to find the ones I love found you, and I find it bittersweet, cause you gave me something to lose. Why are you match clapping? <laughs> this is supposed to be happy. Why are you match clapping? <laughs> You were like, girl, she didn't sing WAP. <laughs> Mac trying to save themselves. Wow. Thank you, Kobobo, for redeeming. Even though, I don't know why. I, I sung it so low. I don't know why I did. Any other stallers? Anybody else we're going to redeem? Otherwise, I'm going to go make dinner. Even though it's 2 p.m., I'm going to make dinner. It's going to take an hour. Best singer since Dua Lipa? Don't say that. <laughs> the stands are gonna come for me. What's for dinner? Your mom. Smile. <laughs> Dua Leo? Guinness. Thank you for stalling, Go Bobo. Now I have less time to make dinner. Oh, wait, for dinner, I'm making um, salmon rice. Or it's like baked sushi rice, essentially. I messed up the O. I can't clock in. I think you clocked in already, alien. Yeah, you clocked in already. You can't clock in twice. No overtime here. The only people who get overtime are the people who clip the stream. Get on it, clippers. If you make the most and best clips, you get a gift card. Wow. Alien is a vibe. <laughs> no, I think they're just... Found something to... Make him feel really good, you know, a little bit of fun. I do agree with Max's theory now. <laughs> I screenshot it? Why did- what did you screenshot? Oh, your calligraphy name, really? That's cute. That's cute. That's so cute. Oh, yes, sir! <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I can't. I can't. Mac changed their ch chat color? No. Oh, it just shows up different because this is a third party chat box, so it, it's a different color. I'll post it on eBay. I will copy strike you. I will do it. You can't steal my art. How dare you. Last call. Any more stallers? I have to go make dinner. Any more stallers? I'll be your PR manager. Um, how about a negotiating salary rate of zero to zero dollars? Okay. 
I would like to thank everybody for watching. Any chatter slickers, thank you all for hanging out today. I know stream schedule's been sporadic, but, but, now that my disability benefits are on their way to getting solved, my sister hopefully will get a job soon. Streams will be as often as I can stream. If you are itching for more peace in 70 content, check the pinned chat message, subscribe to my YouTube channels. I have a main channel where you get weekly stream highlights. I know I missed last Friday. Oopsie! Weekly uploads will be on Saturday. That way I have an extra day to edit throughout the week. Clips channel, daily YouTube shorts, and funny haha clips from stream. Guys, subscribe to both. Turn notifications on on the main channel. They need to get views. Smile. Thank you all for hanging out. Once again, thank you to Kobobo and Mac for donating to the channel. Thank you for the subs. You guys unlocked an evening stream for tonight. It'll probably be in like 3-4 hours because I gotta make dinner. Still deciding what I want to do. We can either do like a chill slime rancher or Mario Kart with viewers. A friend of from shorts? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. We're getting a good handful more people from YouTube. Which is very good. Means all the time. I spend like 30 hours a week editing. It's like a full-time job almost. But it's working. Smile. Okay, I'll see you guys later tonight if you're a sub. Make sure you have notifications turned on. That way you can catch every stream. Next main channel, or not main channel, next stream for normal subs or normal followers will probably be Thursday or Friday. My sister might have a meeting that I have to go to, so we'll see. I'll see you guys later. I'll see you guys tonight. Bye bye. <laughs>